Welcome to Awakening You channel. If you appreciate what we do, please support us. Thank you. Welcome. My beautiful beings of light. Another mile marker has passed for those on the earth plane with many more to come. My beloveds these mile markers, if you will, are the breadcrumbs you left for yourselves to following that are showing you who you are and your way back home. My beautiful beings of grace, when you left your forever home to come to the earth plane, each of you was provided with a dose of amnesia. This veiled your awareness of who you truly are and where you reside eternally even when in physical form. The tiny part of energy that actually is in the physical, is minuscule compared to the true energy essence that you really are, my beloveds. You are really residing in at least two different locations at the same time. Smile, some may even be on more planes at the same time. This amnesia has allowed you to then experience the totality of physicality with all the lessons and learning that you scripted for yourselves before leaving the higher realms. The interesting part of the journey is that each of you my beloveds has put into place a remembrance facto, whereby at a given criteria within your scripted contracts with the divine, you are to start sensing that there is something else, and indeed there truly is a big something else. My beautiful beings of light, you are so much more than you think yourselves to be. This is what you are trying to figure out. Since the larger portion of your energies truly live on another plane of existence the communication factor with the larger part of your divine energy is what you are missing along with the creator connection as well. Once each of you decides that you are ready to interact again with your own higher self and the creator, simply place your intention to do just that in your heart chakra. You each came in with your angels and spirit guides. Call them into your awareness or imagination and ask for their assistance. These beautiful beings are your unseen connection to your spiritual home. The Creator would never send its precious children into another plane of existence without surrounding each of you with heavenly love and help to surf the chaotic waves of negative vibrations. My Divine Light Children each of you selected this earthly persona, that you appear to be, before you even incarnated. You had choices of body type, hair color, etc. You also had choices and saw glimpses of the journey that you each were to embark on. My beloveds you agreed to the life script that you drafted for yourselves. You selected your cast of characters including betrayers, villains, parents along with those that are beloved to you. You each placed into your scripts a wake-up call, if you will, to tell yourselves that it is time to wake up from the illusion that you are this physical human form. You are my beloveds a spiritual being having a human experience, not a human having a spiritual experience. Wake up my beautiful beings of light it is so time for you to remember your true source. Your higher selves are constantly sending you out a message now call me in the morning so that you can recognize and remember that you are the smaller part of such a much larger picture. My beloveds it is time to phone home, if you will, and check in with your higher guidance daily. Yes even those that feel as though they are from another star system or galaxy you too are from the one source. You merely have resided on other spheres more than you have resided on Earth, but all essence has come from the one source. Your forever home is where you return when you leave this place. Allow this messenger to take you on a mediation journey. Arrange yourself in seated position or lie down so that you are comfortable. Keep your legs and arms from crossing if at all possible, as this blocks the flow of energy. Cover yourself with a light blanket if you chill easily. We want you comfortable and undisturbed for a while as you journey within yourself through meditation. Close your eyes and take a comfortable deep breath, then comfortably exhale as hard as is possible. With each in-breath, you are breathing in love and renewal. With each out-breath, you are breathing out fear, frustration, and doubt. Take another comfortable deep breath in and comfortably exhale just letting all the stress go. Take another comfortable deep breath in and then just exhaling letting it all go with a sigh as you are breathing out all frustrations of the day. Feel your body relaxing from the top of your head down to your toes. Give yourself permission to feel the calm and peace. Your muscles are feeling loose and limp, so relaxed, so deliciously serene, so wonderfully lazy. Direct your ego self to perch on your left shoulder. Instruct your ego self that it is only to be an observer on this journey, it is not to participate. 
If it helps you to visualize your ego self by identifying it as a symbol or as an object please do so. In your imagination ask through prayer for the Creator to send you down a protective ray of white light by praying mentally something like this My Creator I am asking for a protective ray of white light to enfold me and lift me up so that I am experiencing the very highest of vibrations during this journey into my innermost depths of understanding and being. I am protecting myself my Creator from anything that is not for my highest good on this journey. I am thanking you in advance my Creator for assisting me by sending this ray. I am visualizing the ray in my imagination now coming down through the corner of the area where I am meditating. It is entering into my physical form, permeating all that is within my I am presence. The Creator has responded to your prayer and has gifted you with an iridescent white ray plus a soft pink ray and two golden fluid rays for this journey. The rays are entering into your body through the solace of your feet and moving up through your physical vessel permeating throughout all of your etheric energy fields and physical vessel and into all corners of the actual area that you are meditating in. The rays then are exiting through your crown chakra. The rays are returning to the Creator and cycling back down through you again and back to the Creator in a continuous circular loop. These protective therapeutic rays are in a continuous circular motion while you are in meditation. You are now divinely protected at this moment and nothing can even communicate with you that is not for your highest good, without your permission. My Divine Beings of Light You are breathing very slowly and evenly now, you are feeling secure and safe. Breathe in deeply my beautiful beings of light and feel the lighter relaxed feelings of being protected and divinely guided into this meditation. Breathe in deeply and know that you are breathing to the pulse of the Creator. Listen to the Creator's spiritual heartbeat and feel the unconditional love that courses through you each time you think about this moment. Breathe in deeply allowing and seeing within your spiritual imagination your guardian angels and invited spirit guides as they join you now. The angels take your etheric essence hands and guide you out of your physical body. The angels then direct you into your etheric spiritual heart chakra. An angel has been stationed to stay with your physical essence until you return from your meditation journey. You are seeing, feeling and sensing this within your imagination, your guardian angels, spirit guides and special invited guests are with you now within your spiritual heart chakra. Your angels and guides are helping you locate the golden door that says to my highest guidance within. You have located the golden door and now you turn the etheric spiritual door knob, opening the door as you cross over the threshold knowing that you are on a spiritual growth adventure. You find yourself in a white marble corridor. Your angels and spirit guides are moving with you down the hall to the third door on your left. The label on this door says My Higher Self. You open the door and cross over the threshold. There in the center of the room you see a giant crystal ball surrounded by a circle of padded benches. The crystal ball is glowing with light but at the moment is clouded. Your angels ask you to have a seat on one portion of the circular benches facing the crystal ball. You sit down and find that the cushions are wonderfully soft and fuzzy. Now your angels relay that they would like for you to call in your higher self. You can do this, your angels tell you, by simply placing that intention to communicate within your own heart chakra. You do as the angels have advised and as you place your intention into your own heart chakra, you sense a wonderful warm loving sensation coming from your heart chakra. The crystal ball becomes clear and there before you is your actual higher self. Your angels remind you to remember that a physical body is not who you are. Have patience with yourself in understanding and accepting the appearance of your higher self as a pure energy essence. Your higher self is communicating with you via telepathy. It wants you to know how much it loves you and misses you. Your higher self is relaying that it is very difficult to watch part of itself actually go through the lessons and learning that was scripted. It honors you for your playing the part so masterfully. This communication and remembrance of your forever connection is bringing tears to your eyes. The tears of joy and remembrance are streaming down your cheeks. The angels hand you a tissue as you dab your eyes not wanting to miss a second to be with your higher self. Your higher self has a surprise for you. It asks you to close your eyes and sense the higher presence of your very own Creator. This phenomenal wave of deep love just wafts over your presence. You feel at awe over the deeper love that comes through. This beautiful energy erases all doubt. 
you know instantly that you are indeed a child of the Divine. The tears continue to flow as the presence of the Creator and your higher self is so overwhelming beautiful and comforting. It clears all fears. You know without a single doubt that this human vessel is temporal but your true essence is eternal and immortal. You understand at a much deeper level that this physical form that you occupy is like a disposable paper plate and when its purpose is fulfilled, it is to be discarded with respect as you return to your heavenly plane of existence. This revelation and remembrance brings so much clarity and confirmation for you. This awareness provides you an instant feeling of deep-seated peace, acceptance and understanding. You are seeing the larger blueprint and know that you are a key player in the overall design of the Divine. The tears cease as the dawning of the true acceptance of this revelation brings back those last moments in your heavenly dwelling before assuming the incarnation you are currently participating in. Your incarnation mission is crystal clear. Your Source and Higher Self are crystal clear. You are once again feeling your true essence, as you truly are, when you are not in physical manifestation. For a moment you merge back with your higher self. That feeling brings closure to your prior feelings of being disconnected and unloved. Your higher self wants you to bring these memories back with you. It says it is time for this remembrance to be yours once again, it will help you fulfill your mission's final steps. Your higher self also tells you that for the moment it is time to return from meditation to continue with your work. Your angels and higher self remind you that you may return here at any time you choose now that you have remembered the way. Sadly but content for the awareness, you touch the crystal ball one more time and get up from your seated position. You and your angels walk back to the door, cross over the threshold and walk back down the hall. You instantly find yourself back in the white marble corridor. You catch a glimpse of your glowing essence in the mirror. You remember your higher self and the Creator as you lightly touch the mirror. Your angels lead you back across the threshold of the golden door within, back into your spiritual heart chakra and then they assist the return of your spiritual essence back into your physical form. Take a deep breath to help you reorient as you wiggle your fingers and toes. When you are ready open your eyes. Go about your day remembering that your inner higher wisdom and angelic support staff are always at your service working with you to help you reach your highest most appropriate potential. Listen for those first thoughts that pop into your awareness and know without a shadow of a doubt that you are receiving daily spiritual guidance. Beloveds you are blessed beyond words and loved beyond measure, more than any earth plane language can ever express. I am Archangel Michael the Creator's messenger, of love, joy, wisdom, light, peace, and grace.